How are you guys? This is IBU Learning, the place to develop your CAD BIM skills. So here I am going to show you how you can make cotton wool and create the quantity sketch wool. So I will go to architectural tab and go to wall here I will choose a store front or I will create a small like 6 meter pattern this is around 4 pieces it's ok now I will click here in 3D then I can see to south view from level 1 to level 2 4 meter just okay I will change this one 6 uh, 3, and then this one from up to level 2 zero. this is okay so I will go to modify this one 1.2 meter maximum spacing this is for vertical grids and horizontal 2.4 meter to swing I will keep here 2 meter only apply ok so now this is the cotton wall I have now I will go to here the view And here, a schedule. I can click pick from here, schedule and quantities, or I will move on the property, project browser. In the down, I can see here schedule quantity also. So here, right click, and I can create new schedule. Here, this is for curtain wall. So I'll go in the curtain wall, curtain panel. Cotton system and cotton mood line also there. So first, I will go to cotton panel. This is new construction. Click OK. Here, I have to create the schedule with having panel with uh, area, length, uh, length and width. So, here I will go to choose assembly name then I will go to pick the area I need length height and I have width here so assembly name area height width I need to be add cost also so I will add cost here I can rearrange this one up. so assembly name after that I need height so I can move up then width I can move up then area then cost I'll click OK. It will create the schedule here. Assembly name is not showing anything, so I will move here the plan. I will check this curtain wall. I will hover over there and hit the tab key to select this. This is the family name system panel. So I will go again in the panel schedule. Click on the edit field. I will remove this. 
then I will add here family and type and here I will move it in the first column then it's come system panel glazing system panel glazed this is the height width area 2 meters square and the cost cost is not showing because we didn't provide anything in the cost so now I will go here in the plan and then I will go to edit this is system panel glazed in I will go down here here in identity data I will see here is the cost so I can put cost here but I will do one more thing I will go to okay, I will move to the panel I will go to edit I need to add here cost I want to add unit cost so I will use unit cost here this is like a type parameter all type of this cotton one will have same yes common and then I will have uh, this one is currency and then ok so I will remove the cost there will be unit cost I will move up so I will have family height width unit cost and then I will have area of the panel and then I will have total cost this is common this will be also currency and then other this will also type parameter and ok then I will click ok so now it's showing unit cost and area and total cost now I will go to put unit cost for the panel I will move again to the level 1 plan I will hit the tab key to select this panel and I will go to edit here you can see I added here in others unit cost and total cost unit cost I will give you for the panel hundred dollars then apply okay so you can see here it's showing 100 for the cotton wool unit cost here I have 2 meter I'll go to edit tab and then I will use this fx calculated parameter now here I have to add total formula I need to be unit cost into area divided by 1000 square okay oh, this zone cost this total cost okay this is not coming here so I will delete this so this is total sign here actually this area I'll change the unit I will go the area filter family and type area format square meter I will keep up to two decimal and then total field K 
currency zero decimal so this is the total area now I'll go to edit fill then formatting total then I will select here calculate totals ok now I will do same for the mullion I will go here next this time I will go to view schedule new schedule now I will cut in all mullion cut in all panels cut in all mullion mullion schedule I can write any name here the new construction ok here also I will choose family name and type this time here I will go to add length cost mullion type mullion length mullion cost and then total I need to be add here so this million cost is I can consider this one I will add here total here length currency other type parameter ok In this total I will add total cost is currency and then here cost same I will do here cost into length divided by 1000 ok so I have million family length of the million this is actually I don't need this one so I will delete this need cost this is called uh, unit cost unit cost and total cost so again I will move to the first level first plan I will select for any one million and then I will go to put the value this time here ok I will not go to edit here I will put the same cost here per linear meter million is saying 50 dollar then ok once I put the value I will go to the million schedule I will see it's already unit cost 50 and then total cost it's showing this much and here in the edit field I will go to the format unit cost edit field if I need in zero decimal then I can change to total cost also I need in zero decimal so this is the uh, one more thing I have to do here in the format cell I will go and I will go in total cost I will select this calculate totals then sorting grouping I will family type and then that's one footer total title count and this then here total calculate total yeah now it's ok so like this we can make the mullion schedule and uh, sorry this panel schedule and as well as mullion schedule with the cost quantities thanks for watching please subscribe for upcoming videos Thank you.